Hello there, my doorsman. Today I've got the Lucky Tackle Box and the Mystery Tackle Box. I will be uh, comparing the two, giving the likes and differences, which one's better, and all this. Uh, I probably will get another two next month, and then I'll decide which one I like better. Uh, so, we'll see. But uh, I got most of the prices pulled up on my phone so I can compare the prices. But let's get started. Alright, the first thing we're going to pull out is the Live Target Gizzard Shed. The Gizzard Spawn, or the Shad Spawn, wasn't too long ago, so this will be working pretty good. It's a light, nice small one. Good color on it. On here it says it's $12.99, and online it says it is... Uh, let's see. It's twelve ninety nine for the fifty one M, which is what that is. I don't know if you could tell. All right, then the next thing is the the Black Angel Lures Intruder Swim Bait Head. There's a three eight three eight three eighths ounce in green pumpkin. It's got the corkscrew head on it. It's a five aught hook. A nice looking uh, head. Alright, it is five dollars for the single one. And if you go on the website, that's the exact same one. It's five dollars. Alright, the next thing will be the fishing physics grubs. This is a uh, three inch black soaked in earthworm there's three of them in here all right this it says it is uh, four dollars a pack and uh, that is for a four pack or that's for a three pack and online it's a five pack for, or a four pack for five dollars So the price is a little off on how much this is. It'd be a little cheaper. Alright, the next thing is the Mustad hooks. It's a wide gap shiner hook and one knot. They're saying these are $4.99. And uh, I couldn't, I can't find these online. I don't know how much they really are. I can't see three hooks being five dollars. But it may be so you may need to do your own research on those. But it's the uh, wide gap slash shiner hook. Alright next thing in here is the River to Sea uh standing Yabby 80. It is in uh black magic and red flake. These say this is the surprise item. Surprise item. They say they're $4.99 a pack. I can go to the River to Sea online page and get the same pack for three dollars. Go ahead and show you this. They're nice looking crawfish. Got the hook already built in, so when you it's gonna float like that when you're when you're fishing it. Even so, this was a five dollar box for me. So even with it being five dollars, or uh, even with it not being the same exact prices on here, it's still worth the money. They claim it's thirty one dollars or thirty one ninety seven. Uh, it's pretty close to $31.97. It's not too far off. Alright, we're back with the Mr. Tech box. Got everything pulled up on my phone so I can compare the prices. Let y'all know the prices. Alright. So we'll start out with the live target. This is a Threadfin Shad Bait Ball. Open it up, let y'all see it. I can get it open. 
this is a cool looking thing. It, it's got three different fish in it. It's supposed to look like three fish swimming together, I guess. From the bottom and the top and the back, it doesn't look like it. It just, but from the if it's hitting it from the side, it looks like it. Uh, says it's fifteen ninety nine for this one. Pull up on the phone. And yes, it's fifteen ninety nine on Tackle Warehouse. Now if you can see that, it's on sale right now, fifteen ninety nine. The next thing is the uh, uh, their free sample is the uh, bait mate fish attractant. It's been the free sample for a couple weeks now, or a couple months now. I don't ever use it, it's just too much of a hassle for me. Alright, the next thing is the bonehead tackle. Uh, this is the 7 inch ringworm in June bug. It's got a lot of nice ripples in it, curly tail. June bug looks pretty much like most of the June bugs you see. And you leap look to it. It is uh it's a four pack. They they say it's 180 for a four pack. Online this it is a sample pack because online there are ten packs. And for the ten pack it is four fifty or four forty nine as you can see right right there 449 for the 10 pack so do the math it may add up I don't think it does alright the next thing is the big bite baits uh, swimming crawl alright a little small crawl it's supposed to it's uh, legs are supposed to flutter as you pull it in they say it's 233 for a four pack this is I don't know what color this is it looks like just uh, regular watermelon green pumpkin maybe for the four pack it's uh, 233 and on here for the let's see six pack it's two ninety nine so those numbers don't match up at all if you can get two more for sixty six cents those numbers aren't adding up all right next thing is the VMC swinging rugby rugby jig this is a three fourth ounce As you can see, the head swings back and forth. It's got a flat bottom on the head. Oops. This is a brown. And I can't can't remember what size hook it said on it. But uh, these are two this is, these are two packs. It's the actual size pack they come in. And It says they're $5.99 for a two pack. And on Cabela's, which is a retail store, which it should be more, it's $4.79. So you get a dollar and twenty. You can get them for a dollar twenty cheaper. Too. Same size, as you can see, three fourths ounce. Same size and everything. So I don't know where they got that number from. Put this back real quick. Alright, and then the next thing is the 8 inch or the Bass Attacker 8 inch attacker needle. It's a needle worm in June bug. It looks really nice. It comes in a 4 pack for 130. See? Alright. And online, online you can get the, mm -hmm. 
the 10 pack for 325 so you can get them for 30 32 cents a piece pretty much so these, that number matches up pretty much almost matches up all right so the first thing I'm gonna compare is the two live targets uh, this live target is from Lucky Tackle Box. A real, it's really realistic looking, perfect for the time of year. I think it'll get a lot of hits on it. It dives. I think it was. Uh, let's see. It dives from three to five. I mean, it just looks really real. It's got rattle, rattles in it. Really sharp hooks. All right. And then from Mystery Tackle, you have the Live Target Threadfin Shad Bait Ball. I gotta say, I do not like this. From behind, it doesn't look like a fish at all. It just looks like a hollowed plastic body. Uh, from the sides, it does look pretty good. It's, it has a rattle in it too. The rattle is not as loud. It's only got one ball in it. Uh, and this one dives from, let's see, I think it's the same depth, three to four feet also. This one is more expensive. It's $3 more expensive. But I definitely like the Lucky Tackle Box one a lot better. To me, it just seems like it's going to get a lot more bites, especially the time of year it is. This color doesn't work in my uh, my area really good, and this one does. So I think I'm going to have to go with this one on Lucky Tackle Box. Next thing we're going to compare is the hooks. On the Lucky Tackle Box, you got the swinging rugby jig. Go over it one more time. It just has a swinging head on it. So it'll, the bait will still move around on the hook. I really like these. And then Lucky Tack Box got us some wide yap shiner hooks. And then the intruder green pumpkin uh, head for it. This, these two, I mean, it's better because you get two. But I like these a lot better because I like the action on them. I mean, when it's going down, it'll float down. It'll shutter on its way down. I think it's going to present it with a little bit more, you know, with a little bit more looks to it. The only thing, well, both of them mark their prices up. I have no idea how much this is, but I highly doubt it is uh, five dollars for three of them. I highly doubt it. So I really don't know. This jig I like, but it comes with one, which is all right. But I think for the hooks itself, Lucky Tack or uh, Mr. Tackle Box is gonna win it because I just like these a lot. All right, the next thing will be soft plus. All right, for Lucky Tackle Box, you got the Physics Grubs in black, and you also have the River to Sea uh, San and Yabby Aggie in black or black and red. On Mr. Tackle Box. You got the Bass Attacker. These are the needle or attacker needles. Got a four pack of those. You got the seven inch ringworm from Bonehead. Four pack of those. And you got the big bite bait swimming swimming crawl. Four pack of those. The one thing I don't like, I got two of the same colors uh, from these, black and black. Bone or uh, Mr. Tacklebox kind of switched it up. I got the green pumpkin. I got the June bug. No, this is the June bug, and I think this is the red bug. I think. So I got three different colors. Also with these, I have three different packs of soft plastics. So I mean, this gives you more opportunity to try new things. Really, I do like these though. I do like Lucky Tackle Boxes, but. These kind of just outnumbered them. Both of these are full packs, and these are all 
uh, trial packs. So one thing I don't like, I'd rather have more full packs. But other than that, I think Mystery Tackle Box won this part just because they got different colors and three different kinds to try. Alright, so we got two, the two magazines, as you can see. Just size comparison, the difference in sizes. Uh, this one, it has a lot, they both have a lot of information, don't get me wrong, but reading through it, I think that this one just has a lot more information, I mean it's just got pages and pages of it. So, and it's got the charts for like the bite times, when the best time is going to be biting the fish is. Uh, they do this each month so you can see like uh, see the primary times, the moon set, uh, what days is the best, and then the average on fishing for the day. And then also you got the five dollar gift card in the back. You got a few knot tying tips and then a recipe. But you also have, like I said, the gift card in the back, so you got five dollars. So this box was completely free to me. Lucky Tackle Box gave a free box pretty much because that was $5. And I got a $5 gift card, which I'll use. And then uh, this one, it's just smaller. Doesn't have as much information in it. I like both magazines, but Lucky Tackle Box wins for just reading part. And then the last thing that I do like about Mr. Tackle Box is they give this kind of like lotto scratcher thing which I'll scratch off real quick see if I won anything haven't won anything yet so we'll see as you can see I didn't win anything uh, this month I don't know who won it I'm gonna go in and add up the uh, I'll go in and add up the prices see which one gave a better deal I think the better deal went to the Lucky Pack a lot. But I will be getting one more month with two boxes. So I'll have one more of these comparison videos. And then I will decide which one I like. And start doing those every month. So far, just from the reviews I've heard, is the Lucky Pack box is the best. But I want to see what it is for myself. Uh, thanks for watching, stay tuned for more videos, and have a good day.